An Army veteran from Vancouver has a love of birds and has found a way to use that love to help others. He started a bird rescue nonprofit almost 20 years ago. Wasn't until recently he found a different way to serve. KGW's Devin Haskins is here with the story, and Devin, he's helping other veterans with his work. Yeah, he is. It's a pretty cool story. His name is Christopher Driggins. Friends uh, know him as Birdman aptly kind of <laughs> appropriate. When he noticed most of those applying to adopt birds were veterans, he started a new nonprofit and called it Parrots for Patriots. Okay. Cheech, I'm going to shoot you. <laughs> Bang! It's safe to say that Christopher Driggins has a Good special girl. relationship Swing. with his birds. Swing. This is Chiquita, okay. a bird he's owned for 10 say years. Hi. Chichi, say hi. And in the same space are other exotic birds just like him, each without a home, well, at least for now. This is Sunshine. She was a showbird and um, actually won first prize when she was fully feathered. Caesar. Each one has their own unique set of struggles. Over here's baby Boo Boo. She's had her toes chewed off, so she has to have special perching. And they're not alone. I've always had a constant stammer and stutter. In the same way that he helps his birds recover, they help him too. Uh, I noticed my stammering and stuttering stopped. All the negative things I had on mine stopped. He also knows he's not alone. I knew that how they helped me with my stammering and stuttering problem. Um, and it was like a closeted little secret. Ready to go on a ride? So on this day, he's bringing sunshine to her new home and riding alongside him, his companion bird, Chiquita. Hi. Driggins is heading north of Olympia to meet sunshine's new owner, Leslie Seabird, an army veteran just like him. Well, it's just fine to have a perfect bird, but that's the same creature. And it's the right thing. What's the kitty say? Wow. Yeah. Sunshine will join nine other birds. Almost all here are rescues. There is nothing like bird love. Um, they're wild animals and you can't foster your relationship by punishing them at all. Owning a bird is like raising a toddler every day, and for those with PTSD and daily struggles in life, a bird is actually the perfect companion. They keep you so busy you don't have time to think negative or do anything else. And the perfect way to end Dragon's story is to let the bird do the talking. Bye -bye. <laughs> so how successful is the program? <laughs> bye bye! <laughs> He's adopted out over 200 birds. To veterans in the last uh, four years. Yeah. Great work there. It oh, is yeah. great work, yeah. Oh, yeah. How many bye byes did you get from that bird? I got uh, four, five, six. Yeah. Got a bunch of highs. <laughs> yeah. Once they start, they yes. do not to stop. Talk to All the right. bird man. All right, Devin, thank you.